Oh, look at him go. Most inventors try to advance technology. The Needham brothers don't. They just like to have extreme fun. Like a giant bubble room at the bottom of a lake. This is absolutely nuts. We're standing at the bottom of Lake Tahoe. Or a machine that lets you bounce across the desert. Woo! You're going to take that machine and push it to make them fly higher, faster, and farther than ever before in just two days. Hope this thing works. <laughs> This is really hard. Is this going to work? I have no idea. I'm John Bowler. I build contraptions. That's the dumbest thing I've built all week. You name it, and I build it. We're going to have fun here. I also look for the craziest garage inventors out there. I think he's completely out of his mind. And put them to the ultimate test. Oh. Make their wildest inventions do something totally new. This is really starting to get weird. In front of a crowd in just two days. Cross your fingers and move away from your TV set. What's in your neighbor's garage? The Needham Brothers. Two mad scientists who invented an extreme jumping machine in the desert. Whoa! I'm going to work with them to make it even more extreme. <laughs> but first, I have to find them. Hey, guys. Logan, Jordan, Lake, snow, cold, and <laughs> buried. <laughs> so what are we looking at here? My brother and I built a bubble room. It's basically a, an underwater chamber of air that we can go check out and out hang there. out in. Yeah, 15 feet like under the water. How do we get there from here? Uh... The only way, swim. Good thing I just happened to be wearing a wetsuit today. <laughs> and what would a mad scientist use to seal the leak in a bubble room? What else? Bubble gum. Gum worked out. To plug the holes. Tape will work too, but tape you gotta keep dry on the way out. What holes? <laughs> <laughs> what holes? In the dome. It's it. Oh. Time to get in the pool. absolutely nuts. We're standing at the bottom of Lake Tahoe. <laughs> yeah. But it's fun, right? I mean, why would these guys build this thing at the bottom of a lake? Hey, why not? They came up with the idea, and they thought it was fun. There's the gum. <laughs> That's why they do everything fun. First, we attach the net to this big metal ring, and then we start the plastic out underneath the net. And fill it over there. there. We get fresh air in here from the diving tanks we brought down. This is like super cool, you guys. Have you guys invented anything like on land? Yes. And so we go from the freezing water to the desert. 